Hey, good morning, everybody. Robin here. Welcome to my channel, Aries Fire Tarot. Um, I'm doing a daily tarot card reading for the collective for Tuesday, August 17th. So whatever your zodiac sign is, if you were guided here today, there's probably something, a message coming through uh, my guides as I channel them through the Starman tarot card deck for you guys. So just wishing you guys love and light, many blessings on your day ahead. And thanks so much for joining me. Um, I just wanted to throw in you guys that I had mentioned uh, about my thyroid. I guess it's called a disease or whatever uh, a little while back. And I actually stumbled across something that I found very interesting because I noticed that every time I had an apple, I would start to cough. So I did some research on it and I'm allergic to birch trees and there's a protein in apples that is very similar to whatever is going on in birch trees. So I figured out that I was actually allergic to apples and that could have been having a huge impact on my health as well because I was eating an apple every day for my morning, my mid morning snack. So, um, just wanted to throw that out there and just really thank you guys for all your caring comments and possible solutions and stuff like that. So I did find that out and it kind of blew my mind. But anyway, let's get into your reading before I just run away um, with the conversation. Starman Tarot Card Deck for the Collective, Tuesday, August 17th. What have we got here? We've got the Prince of Cups. So it does look like there's some sort of very attractive offer coming in for you today. For those of you that are single, you could possibly be asked out for a date. Um, you, this could be a time for you to also ask somebody else out. Like instead of sitting back and waiting for an offer, you could project an offer to somebody um, whatever this offer is, it's being made with love and really pure intentions. The Prince of Cups is just this beautiful energy coming in for you. So if you're not on the hunt for romance, this could be another very attractive offer coming in for you that would just sort of fill your heart up with joy. Um, you know, it could be anything. There's so many different ways of receiving uh, wealth and abundance from the universe. So I don't like to really just focus on romantic love. But for those of you that have been single uh, for a long time and just waiting for, you know, your knight in shining armor or for your prince to arrive, it looks like your prince is arriving. So I mean, that's a good start. I love that when when the reading starts off on a really high note like that. So expect something really nice to happen today. Okay, and yesterday was, you guys had to really take charge of that. So the universe is recognizing that you're able to change your energy and project it out. And now you're receiving that back very quickly, very quickly indeed. Okay, so let's have another card here. Um, you do have the five of pentacles. So this is going to be a surprise offer. Is something that you did not see coming. You know, things are not visible immediately before they manifest, okay? You could see other people around you receiving all kinds of, like, bounty, like, love offers, job offers. Just everything is going to everybody else. But it, now it's your turn. It is your turn, okay? So... It just really is a beautiful energy with this five of pentacles. You can see that there's this person sort of lost behind everything. I'm being guided to just do another deck cut. Okay, so <clears throat> the eight of cups. You guys could be compelled to move on and just feel really crappy about what is happening. Like, why is everybody else getting offers? Why is everybody else getting results? The Eight of Cups, like, look at his pose here. It's like, what do I do with this mess, okay? Don't worry about it for too long. Just remember how successful you were yesterday morning at breaking your own energy. And keep focused on what is being offered to you and, and multiplying it for your highest good, okay? So I'm actually being guided to just clarify the five of pentacles for you guys again okay because 
Fives are very uncomfortable energy. If you think about the five of wands, you know, it's like not getting involved in something, um, you know, uh, the five of swords. It shows like a very chaotic battlefield. Um, what am I forgetting? <laughs> Drawing a complete blank. Uh, five of cups being very melodramatic and very sad. And the five of pentacles is kind of wondering, where's my stuff at? You know, uh, did the universe lose my order? Okay, so that's not happening here. It's just maybe they shipped it to the wrong address and finally everything got corrected. So I want to write that down. Hold on for a second, guys. So the good news is we started off with that offer, okay? But you don't know that it is about to arrive. So your general overall feeling could be that, why, you know, why me, okay? So let's pull another card over the Eight of Cups. You've got the hanging man here. It's called the hanged man here. So, you know, when somebody else is more successful at what you've been trying to do for a long time, let's take romance or money, jobs, um, there's a different way of looking that, at that. Like you could look at somebody else's blessing as evidence that your blessing is just about to arrive. You know, you could be happy for other people. You know, because if other people can succeed at love, money, work, whatever, you can succeed too. So instead of looking at yourself as deprived, look at yourself as being very fortunate because you can do whatever anybody else can do. So stop feeling sorry for yourself, like to the best of your ability with this Eight of Cups. He's just like, uh, I can't continue to go on like this, right? And the five of pentacles, it's like your your fame and fortune, your wealth and abundance, your love, whatever, shrouded in mystery, but it's on its way. It maybe had to stop and touch on other people. It's like, I'm getting the word like a milk run for some reason. You know, have you ever been on a bus in the country? I, I used to visit some friends of mine. They live way out in the country why is this coming up right now? But I'm just going to continue to explain that because it will be revealed. And there's no like marker or bus stop, but you could just kind of go stand on the road and the bus would stop and pick you up. Okay. So basically you just have to make your presence known and that you're available. And by casting envy or jealousy onto somebody because they have experienced the success that you want, maybe the bus will go right by you. And, and that's not what you want. You want to show up and go, well, that bus is going to stop and pick me up, right? Because I showed up. A weird analogy, weird visual that I'm getting here. But <clears throat> I think that makes sense. You know, you basically just have to keep on showing up and the bus of fortune is going to stop and open its doors for you. Um, we do have the high priestess. So the high priestess is very, <clears throat> she lets go of all constraints. You can see here that she's sailing through her day regardless of what the universe is putting in front of her. She's also very intuitive. She's very heart forward. Today might be a good day to really open your heart to other people Say, I'm so happy for you that you received that. Like, what a blessing. And be genuine about it. Um, I, I get a visual of this. I think it was a Miss America or some sort of pageant. And, you know, they had the finalists and then the winner was announced. And they panned off to this, this person that she was a runner-up. And she was genuinely overflowing with joy that her fellow contestant won instead of her. So it's okay to be happy for other people. In fact, it's highly recommended that you're happy for other people, that they have their success because you're sharing in that, you're sharing in the energy. You know that the bus is coming for you, even though you might be lost in the wilderness with this five of pentacles. 
but if you keep on standing there long enough, it's going to pull up and open its doors. And I got some really weird visuals on this one. But just remember, your offer is on the way today. You should see evidence of it. Just stand there hopeful and the 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 bus of luck is going to show up and open its doors. Really weird. Anyway, guys, <laughs> I'm going to go. <laughs> Bye. Take care. Bye.